Alright everyone, it is me, Johnson Chan, and uh, oh great, splashed a little bit of water there. So uh, I didn't do any research at all, uh, I was managing mostly my uh, EverQuest stuff, but also just uh, doing some other research. Didn't even, I mean I was particularly stressed out yesterday, so I didn't work on my game, but today I kind of want to work on it, you know, just something simple like the, uh, like changing the volume and stuff. So, uh, and of course, you know, the fucking Windows updates has like 10,000 updates and it's constantly bringing my uh, laptop down. It's like very annoying. So, oh well. All right, anyway, uh, I don't know, let's just see what's happening this week. All right, so Bitcoin searches for this week is actually stable at 12. I have to admit, I'm actually pretty surprised. I thought this would have just collapsed like it all usually does when prices go down. But this is good. It means that people are still very interested in crypto. All right. Uh, for some reason, they're just not buying. I guess, I, I guess it's because everything's just going to crap. All right. So prices look good here. Twenty-four volume on coin market cap is actually a little under two fifty billion. That's actually insane. Uh, coin Gecko says one thirty-one, a little under one thirty-one billion. Yeah. So there's something definitely happening here. So Bitcoin dots at fifty-five point sixty-six percent. So this is really good. So that means we should be seeing money flowing back into the crux uh, at some point. Uh, let's see, Bitcoin's at 10,412, uh, Litecoin's at 4911, uh, Dogcoin is at 354 million market cap. So what this tells me is a lot of assholes are dumping their coins, but there's also a lot of other people that are, are really buying up coins. So, uh, like, uh, like, who knows? So markets are back up today, so this is good, so this little bullshit uh, correction mini correction seems to be gone right? because I would have accepted flatlining or going up um, but, but as long as it doesn't continue going down that's that, that's what's good stocks point higher tech shares look to rebound weakless job claims higher than expected um, it's actually going down it's actually 850k so they're just running fake news terrorism because they want to get rid of Trump and it's just starting to piss me off because the, these assholes, these shit lib fake news terrorist assholes, are the reason why the bull market is not going as high as it's supposed to, right? Because if you remember, before all this lockdown bullshit happened, you know, uh, cryptocurrency was skyrocketing, right? And then they, they kept screwing it up. All right, uh, blah, 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 let's see. Short seller hit earlier. The electric term to call it is an intricate fraud in Newport. Uh, well, that should be illegal, obviously. But because uh, he's a short seller, he's you know saying everything's a fraud. I mean, because obviously he's shorting the stock. I mean, it's pretty obvious. So yeah, there's actually nothing. Uh, I have I have hang down on mental health. Ah, so now they're starting to real. So now they're starting to acknowledge that people are getting mentally getting really pissed off about this. Uh, yeah. So we'll see. Ah, oh, Evans doing pretty well. Any options? Uh, no options. I don't know, has it been three months? I imagine it might have been already. JPC codes at four to five, so hopefully this will recover. I already see not a whole lot going on here. 404 coin has actually been gaining strength because everything else has been collapsing and people don't want 100 coin or speed coin because they're greedy idiots. You know, and which is fine, you want to play greedy, but you're going to get burned, right? Because 404 is going to become like two by two in rips, you know? Uh, I also took a look at the uh, cryptocurrencytalk.com and like I see Mitch was promoting Ricks in 2x2 but not like our other projects they work together. And I'm still kind of pissed, because, a little pissed because he's like, well you should be new, making new projects on your own. Well that's what you fucking did. You know, I, never t I didn't get a chance to tell him that but I will be telling him that uh, if he ever does message me again. Right? But I mean... At this point, it kind of just seems obvious that he's just like doing his own thing. So, yeah. So, I mean, I'll still maintain the servers, but then that's that, you know. So, uh, yeah. Um, yeah, and that's pretty much it. So, 404 is at 71 to 72. So, it's uh, doing all right. So, that's something. Uh, 2 by 2 is at 7 to 8. Oh, it actually gotten has gotten better. Well, that's nice news. So seven to eight, it really should be worth 20 or 30, but I don't know, everyone's just being a paranoid asshole dumping everything right now. 
Rix is at 20 to 20 cents. So this will remain volatile until we can figure out what the real price is. Uh, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna uh, start back up uh, advertising for 100 coin. So, because uh, it's way underpriced. Like all these cryptos are way underpriced, and no one's buying it, and it's just like getting very frustrating. So right now it's at 147, uh, 14.7 to 16.9 satoshis of a Bitcoin. But um, you know, at least I'm finally starting to see some buying pressure here. Uh, also, it's like 9:53 a.m. So usually the buying doesn't start until somewhere between now and then, like uh, you know, 1 p.m. my time, uh, New York time. So we'll see how much they buy today, the market, uh, if any. Uh, speed coins at 114.1 and 147 uh, satoshis of a Bitcoin. I'm not. I'm gonna for now try to concentrate on rehabilitating a 100 coin. Speed coins doing okay. And it's mostly because you know the supply is so restrictive. So and there's no state and I did not create I deliberately did not put it on BTC pop for a staking pool. So, you know, basically forcing people to buy a bunch of coins and then stake it yourself. So, you know, which means you more buying pressure. Uh let's see. So the polls still continue to Yeah, so yeah. I mean this is about what I expected. Is that Trump is actually much further ahead, but at this point no poll can be trusted. Um, or you just simply deduct 10 points from Joe Biden, add 10 points to Trump, right? Because because you can't say you're voting for Trump, right? You'll just lose everything. People will try to come and kill you, uh, courtesy of Antifa. So, uh, and really, just anybody that hates white people, really. Uh, the oh my God, will you get out? Oh my God, these are real world uh, are not made up lies by the enemy. Thank you. Know. Is unrivaled. Yeah. Uh, I I want I mean I kind of want to just get off and do my other thing, but uh, oh yeah, everyone now 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 everything thinks I'm in Brazil or Argentina, cause, you know, on the proxy. So we're going to go to school safely now. When school to call, let the wife follow the child family. Why should school Why should schools be paid when they are closed? They should. Oh, what? So schools are closed, but they're still getting money. What a fucking scam! Like we like I. We really should just make liberalism just illegal in America. Like this, this is exactly the kind of scam that just goes on all the time. Blah uh, blah has many. Okay, so blah blah. All right. Um, Eighty million ballots for people who aren't even asking for uh, is unfair. Total fraud. Make you look at what's going on right now. Well, here's the problem. They're just going to print more ballots and just put your vote in, right? So you don't even have to mail it in. Like, that's how they're going to try to steal the election. Uh, I'll go Rockstar. Keep that much. Uh, I think... Let's see. I think she was a huge cunt towards the Groypers. I think. Okay, I'm of two bro. I say it would not have people worn out after girl. I'm not going to make a great deal of it, but blah, 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 blah. Uh, oh, wait. This was August 26th. Oh, this is the Kyle Rittenhouse thing. I actually had forgotten about it. Okay, and then, I don't know, blah, blah, blah. All right, so nothing of note here. All right, let's see. All right, fine. Bitcoin price balances at 10K, next move. Buffett, Sean, Tech, from here until now. What did Boo, Boo, Booey? Yeah, Booey, Bitcoin. I don't know. I don't like Buffett, but he buys Bitcoin, and he does seem to be opening up to crypto. So, all right, tokenized real estate market launches with two thirty-seven million assets. Actually, I'm kind of curious about that. XCIA agent drags my crypto pad into right-wing conspiracy. Wait, XCIA agent drags my crypto patent into right-wing conspiracy. Ah, so we have a fellow conservative who's being slandered. Um. No, do I really want to read this? Uh, all right, we might read it if we don't have any other news. Uh, all right, that's fine. Global blockchain counter by Agorgo. Okay. Um, Washington blockchain voting system shows up on GitHub. Huh, I might be interested in this, actually. Because I'm trying to figure out use cases for, you know, our cryptos here. This one's blank for some Coin Telegraph reporter Turner Wright recently interviewed presidential candidate Brock. All right, well, that's a mute. But the best part is I can't even freaking fucking see uh, the, the, the media. 
How Brock Purdy can become the next U.S. Pro okay. New losses, pro I saw the ground for blockchain crypto two hours ago. Uh, actually, let me um, let me do something. Um, go to my blog here and coin. What are we using? Coin Telegraph. I always confuse it with Coin Desk. Coin Telegraph. There we go. I'll put that as a reminder for myself later. New Swiss lock right ground. Um, Futurama. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I like that. You know, I might not even use Daily Holo anymore. I might just use Coin Telegraph. Yeah, you know what? We'll just use Coin Telegraph because I, I just, I just, I just don't want to waste any more time with the crappy sites. New Swiss law provides solid ground for blockchain crypto. Crypto and blockchain get better legal clarity in the Alpine country. Swiss parliamentarians on Thursday passed a new set of finance corporate. The guard has amended several laws ranging from the company market to securities trading. These set of laws define legalities of exchanging digital currencies and also the define legal requirement. These come out of the blockchain act 2020. It's likely that any new form of existing law to come in effect early next year. With that, the blockchain blah blah blah. So I'm do a bunch of these, including Libra and blah, blah, blah. The EU, mostly known for blah, blah, blah. Okay, blah, blah, blah. Private crypto banks have also sprang up in Switzerland. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Oh, okay, that's in the article. All right, well, that's good. You know, Switzerland's uh, ahead of, getting ahead of the curve. Because the, the Swiss are always the masters of money, right? We're talking in terms of countries, right? That's, that's why they were one of the last holdouts before the IRS finally... You know, threatened to ram a rod up their ass if they didn't, uh, you know, fork over uh, tax dodgers and stuff like that. But before that happened, and they still are technically today. You know, they're they're really good with money. So I'm I'm, I'm glad the Swiss is on top of crypto, and that's a good sign. That's obviously a very good sign, right? If the masters of smart money are getting into crypto, then so so should everyone else. And uh, so far, that does seem to be the case here. Which is uh, very good, right? So that means if you know, I mean, Trump. Let's say he he's probably going to win re-election, which he should. Then they're going to contest the election, and that's going to add more uncertainty. But at least you know we'll get a kind of at least we'll get the formal election over, and then Mark Zuckerberg and big tech and the Democrats are going to spend the next four years trying to you know screw up the election or whatever while, while they start printing more mail-in ballots of course and then say joe biden won you know when when it clearly is bullshit new swiss laws provide solid ground for blockchain crypto crypto and blockchain get better legal clarity in the alpine wait oh i already read that huh. ex-cia agent drags michael crypto blah, blah, blah. marina Iraf, bill gates uh provide this name sounds familiar Cryptocurrency is a climate year of the mainstream pot and all that because it's about to become more blurred. Uh, Kevin Ship, who has close to 150, has now dragged recently into the quagmire. Uh, to a short little of his feature series, ours, Marina Abram. Oh my god, I remember. She's like that weird. Uh, Je okay, that's the Jeffrey Epstein uh, pedophile. Th okay, yeah, I remember. Yeah. Uh,. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to. Well, I guess he wants to attack the pedophiles. I guess. Yeah, I'm. I'm definitely not going to read that. Uh, yeah. But I'm also just not interested because you know there's nothing you could do for now. At least not directly. Russian blockchain voting system show up on GitHub. Uh, blockchain guy keeps betting on blockchain for elections. Oh, this is actually really important. Because you can't do fraud with this. Well, because um, if you give everybody a blockchain code and then they just make their vote and then that's it. The problem is is a new, uh, 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 being anonymous. So you would have to make it so that the only you would have to make it so that the only thing that shows up on the public blockchain is you voted, and then the private part of it will automatically say, "Oh, uh, you know that vote was voted for that person." As Russia is set up to is set to pilot a blockchain-based e-voting system, the country's federal elections authority has provided public access to a platform source code. According to an official announcement, Russia's CEC source code was released on GitHub. 
Judicial release included the source code for smart contract front end elements of the e voting. According to CEC, the internal elements of the e voting are expected to blah, blah, blah. Russia set this pilot its blockchain power voting system at the upcoming elections for the Hey, do our road checks already come early in September? Entering into fourth July fourth. So this is one thing I never even thought of. Like you could you could bypass all the political crap we have to do and just simply have everyone vote for your blockchain. I mean I imagine there's still gonna be some vulnerabilities, but uh if it's done correctly, yeah, it would be impossible to do fraud. Entering into force on July fourth, the amendments allow Vladimir Putin to serve two more six-year terms until 2036 as the vote the blockchain system requires suffered a number of <clears throat> bugs as well as major data breaches are supported by coin telegraph the upcoming e-voting instead of developed card between russia and rostal blah 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 blah, blah. Uh, all my characters are still alive that's a good 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 sign um oh yeah i kind of do need to do this uh let's just do you and do you there we go All right, well, where are we? Uh, blah, blah, blah. All right, that's very good. But this is actually pretty good because, um, yeah, because right now we're dealing with mail-in voter fraud. So if we could get it on blockchain. That could be a really good way of, you know, dealing with uh, voter fraud. Tokenized real estate market plate launches with 237 million in assets. The platform will allow investment in commercial real estate from as little as 5K and liquidity in the form of token back loans during the 12-month period. Okay. Despite receiving hype as a potential killer app for blockchain tokenized assets has in many ways failed to live up to its own promise. Uh, Reno has just launched an investment plan for to uh, U.S. commercial real estate. Now I'm definitely interested because this is what I want to buy. Let's take a look at their site. Covered two thirds of million worth of property at launch. Credit investors globally can now partner in several different offerings, including both private and diversity. Uh, every time I see diversify, I always think diversity. All the products are income producing include medical facility residential buying part. So it's a, so it's just like LoopNet. Uh, okay, let's take a look here. Boca Recovery Center. Let's see. Oh, good. They also hide the uh, addresses. So altitude residential. No, we want commercial real estate. Okay. Yeah, well, I mean, the only way I see is mobile homes. Hmm. Well, I mean, they're still pretty new. With a minimum investment, okay, a lot of them with a minimum of 5K with no fees for creating or maintaining an account or buying tokens. All presidential, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So they're basically an REIT company using blockchain. That's real estate investment trust. So you just basically buy shares of a building or whatever. However, this could change the fear as it all comes down to cho to the choice of tokenization client as Reno seeking other categories of C SEC. By the way, I would, if you know I had money right now, I would not be buying, or I'd be buying at a deep discount because again of the lockdown. Uh, and I know for a fact that income pro income production is also going to be gone or lowered because everyone's unemployed. So. Due to regulation, a real estate investor token that I be traded on secondary market over the over the right now is development model to allow the to instantly approve loans backed by the tokens. The LTV ratio is generally between sixty and eighty-five percent. Excuse me. It's been a while since I had to read this. I had to watch my. Uh, I forgot the that nice black guy's name on YouTube, but he does. He's like the biggest commercial real estate channel on YouTube. And he explained this somewhat complicated thing, but I believe this is a uh, this is the good one. The because I think the lower the number is, the better. Uh, so basically, basically what that means is you have more equity, right? So let's say six million. So let's say uh, let's say it's worth ten. Let's say I bought a uh, apartment building for ten million dollars. Sixty to eighty-five percent means that I borrowed six million to eight point five million to buy. That apartment building that's worth ten million. So I have one point five to four million dollars worth of equity in that apartment building. So that's good because you know when because I guess well, I, I guess if things go down, you know then that you know it's just like cryptocurrency, right? You know it's like oh the value keeps going down but still producing income but it makes people nervous. Blah 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 blah. The savings provide higher level of equity. Other methods of the certainly help that new public to release some of the hype around tokenized real estate. Yeah, I mean, when once all this crap is over, if it ever ends, like the bull market's gonna be so insanely great. 
as Steve Jobs would used to say. Uh, it's gonna it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be pretty nuts. Um, so I'm definitely gonna make this the uh, the the thumbnail. Yeah, this this site is so good. I can't believe I've never used this before. And their pictures are superior to everything else I've seen. And they have a pretty good swath of like actual good articles. All right. Anyway, if you like what you saw, read or heard, hit the like button, the follow button, or subscribe button from wherever you're watching this from, or on my YouTube's at youtube.com forward slash GMC Radio. Make sure you smash that subscribe button on the right side of this page so we can continue growing this channel. All right, so I'm obviously done for the week. Um, all right, I got a lot of crap here to do. So anyway, unless something major happens, I'll see you all next week. And oh my god, yeah, look at the look at these thumbnails. These are so much better looking. Like the, the color, the art, like it's just, yeah, it's very nice. It's very nice. All right, anyway, um. Yeah, right. I got I got I got some work to do today. I didn't like manage my video games. Also, I got to check the laptop. I need to bring my wallets back on, like as a stupid Windows asshole update. You know. So anyway, I'll see you all next week. Thanks for watching, and always remember, Johnson Chan, JMC Coin, 100 Coin, Speed Coin. So the good news is, it looks like crypto is going to be recovering. Uh, the markets, where are you? The markets continue to do pretty well. So whatever that stupid mini correction we just had for like the past you know like basically going to labor day weekend it looks like it's finally over so you know we're not quite out of it yet but it's definitely looking a lot better so i don't know i'm gonna have to hope that because um, i see the trade volume is increasing already on uh correct so hopefully that money should eventually flow back into our tiny little coins i'm also going to start doing uh advertisements um back has a ad Oh, yeah. So I got to check my ads again. So I got a lot to do. So I will see you all next week. And thanks for watching. Yeah. Did I already do my sellout mode? Oh, yeah. I did. <laughs>